Greetings, my name is Lise Curry. I'm pleased to welcome you into my home to share with you the great pleasure I have in being surrounded by all these beautiful artworks that are part of my collection and to relate to you my story as to how I became an avid art collector to my own surprise, I must say. I've been collecting for over 30 years and my collection now numbers over 220 pieces, paintings, sculptures, photography. So as you can see, it's become a very big passion of mine. I started collecting accidentally and modestly. All those years ago, I participated in a street fair where I met the artist Laura James who showed me a painting out of the trunk of her husband's car. I immediately fell in love with it and bought it. It is named Woman Reading and it hangs here in my home. Laura then started to invite me to various art fairs and gallery shows that she participated in. And I started to go to galleries on my own Though I must say that at first, galleries can be quite intimidating. Some of them are not very inviting, but I persisted and it's become one of my great pleasures. Every artwork I've acquired was a result of a coup de coeur. A coup de coeur, as I'm sure most of you know, is the strike of the heart. Well, if I didn't have that coup de coeur for an artwork, it didn't come into my home. So every item in my collection is very precious to me. That's why it so pains me that for lack of space in my home, most of my collection is now in storage, which I think is criminal. So I made it a goal for myself to bring my collection to light. Some years ago, I reflected on gifting my collection and I decided that it should go to an educational institution because I came to realize that many colleges offer only minimal exposure to art. And that's because of the requirements of their curriculum and I understand that. So my goal is to help remedy that in my own small way. The institution I approached was St. Francis College in downtown Brooklyn. I went to them because there is a scholarship at St. Francis in the name of my son, Arthur Curry. I also knew that St. Francis had a gallery space because some years back, one of my artists participated in a group show there. So I arranged to meet with Thomas Flood, the director of advancement, to discuss the possibility of gifting my collection to St. Francis. To his credit, Thomas was very receptive to the idea, and there began a conversation as to how this would happen. I asked Thomas if we could explore the possibility of holding exhibitions curated from items in my collection in their gallery to expose the students and people passing by. I'm happy to say that the first exhibition of this wish of mine is about to become a reality in the fall of 2019. I hope that my story will inspire you to also become collectors. There are so many great emerging artists who can use our support. Even if you acquire only two or three artworks that you're passionate about, well, that makes you a collector in my book. And I hope this exposure will inspire the students to go to museums and galleries, not let themselves be intimidated, just forge ahead like I did. I'm pleased to say that my goal and my wish are about to come true, thanks to St. Francis and the leadership and support of its president, Miguel Martinez Sanz. It's been so rewarding working with them on this project so dear to me. Thank you for listening to me, and I hope to see you in the fall.